I want to welcome you to Soul Food, a ministry of First Presbyterian Church of Wasilla, Alaska. My name is Henry Woodall. I'm the pastor here in Wasilla, and every week I try to post a few scriptures and a song or two, and uh, just as a, a spiritual snack uh, for your week. And I wanted to start off with that hymn today. I was going through the hymn book and found it, and I just thought, hey, it'd be fun to sing hopefully for you to hear. I want to read for you from Isaiah the prophet, the 55th chapter, and it's pretty much the whole 55th chapter. It's a great text, but it goes, come all you who are thirsty, come to the waters and you who have no money, come buy and eat, come buy wine and milk without money, without cost. Why spend money on what is not bread, your labor on what does not satisfy? Listen, listen to me and eat what is good, and you will delight in the richest affair. Give ear and come to me, listen that you may live. I will make an everlasting covenant with you, my faithful love promised to David. You see, I have made him a witness to the peoples, a ruler and a commander of the peoples. Surely you will summon nations that you know not. Nations that you did not know will come running to you because of the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel. For he has endowed you with splendor. Seek the Lord while he may be found. Call on him while he is near. Let the wicked forsake their ways, the unrighteous their thoughts. Let them turn to the Lord, and the Lord will have mercy on them. To our God, for God will freely pardon. For my thoughts are not your thoughts. Neither are your ways my ways, declares the Lord. As the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways. My thoughts than your thoughts. As the rain and snow come down from heaven and do not return to it without watering the earth, making it bud and flourish so that it yields seed for the sower, bread for the eater. So is my word that goes out from my mouth. It will not return to me empty, but will accomplish that I desire and achieve the purpose for which I sent it. You will go out in joy, be led forth in peace, the mountains and the hills will burst into song before you, and all the trees of the field will clap their hands. Instead of the thorn bush will grow the juniper, and instead of the briars the myrtle will grow. And this will be for the Lord's renown, for an everlasting sign that will endure forever. One of the things I enjoy doing is I enjoy uh, learning new hymns, and I look through the hymn book and I find a text that I like. This particular text is based upon some of Isaiah 1, 55, 1 through 11. It's not a tune I was familiar with. I don't really read music as such, but I found a tune that I know, and it fits to this song. So I'm going to sing hymn number 78, the text of it, actually to the tune of... Uh, hymn 318, maybe one that you're somewhat familiar with. Mm -hmm. You thirsty ones, come to the spring. Have you no money? Come buy wine and milk, come buy and eat without a price or sum. Why do you work and earn and spend on that which is not bread? Oh, listen now and come to me, eat what is good instead. This food delights and satisfies the food your God can give. Incline your ear and come to me, oh, hear what that you may live. Return while God may still be found, and call while God will hear. Now let the wicked quit their ways, while yet the Lord is near. 
My word like heaven's snow descends, it falls like heaven's rain. It waters all the thirsty earth and shall not go in vain. It's a pretty good rendition of, uh, of Psalm, or, uh, of Isaiah 55, 1 through 11. Here's another song you may be familiar with. It's kind of fun to... joy by joy <laughs> this day and in the coming days this has been soul food my name is henry woodall this is a ministry of first presbyterian church of first presbyterian excuse me first presbyterian church of wasilla alaska may you have a good day blessed day <laughs>